want to go meatless, I have a good vegetarian recipe for you today. It's called the vegetable spring roll, or we call it uh, vegetable lumpia, or they call it egg roll. Let's get started. For the vegetable spring rolls, which they also call egg rolls, we need one fourth cup of oil, one tablespoon of chopped garlic, one onion sliced, one teaspoon white pepper, two tablespoons soy sauce, two tablespoons fish sauce or patties, two tablespoons brown sugar, one tablespoon chicken powder, and then you need also the wa uh, water that you use in soaking the mushrooms. 20 grams of bukni or tenga ng daga or black fungus or wood ears. Soak in water to soften and then cut into strips. 50 grams of dried mushrooms you soak in water to soften, you cut into strips, and save the mushroom water. One fourth kilo carrots cut into strips. One fourth kilo camote cut into strips. One fourth kilo of cabbage cut into strips. 150 grams of bagyu beans, or any bean, or you can use fresh peas, which we call sitsaro, you cut into strips. 80 grams of sotanghon soaked in water to soften and then after that you cut them into one inch strips. You need spring roll wrappers. I'm using the big one. You need about 25 to 30 pieces depending on how big or how small you want the, wrapper, uh, the lumpia. Then for the paste we need two tablespoons of flour, two tablespoons of water. This is a vegetable, all vegetable lumpia. Uh, in the U.S., they call this egg rolls. I don't know why they call this egg roll when there is no egg at all. But anyway, when they say an egg roll, it's usually a lumpia, okay? I have here oil. You heat the oil, and then you add in garlic. And then you add in onions. I'll add the mushrooms next. You save the water that we use for soaking the mushroom. By the way, you can just use half of the mushroom, okay? And then this is the bukni, or we call that uh, tenga ng daga, or wood ears, or black fungus. Okay? And then we have carrots. Don't shred it, just cut it into strips. And then you have camote. You can also use gabi. Or potato. And then we season with soy sauce, patis or fish sauce. The reason I use patis is for the unami flavor. So you don't need to put vetsin. White pepper, uh, chicken powder, brown sugar. Brown sugar is just to balance. And then we have here the beans okay you will notice that the mixture see water comes out because these are vegetables right so it's expected that there's water coming out so what we do is we add the uh, sotanghon to absorb the extra liquid okay I have here, if you need water, you add the mushroom water. If you don't need it, don't add it, okay? And then we have cabbage. Don't overcook the vegetables since we're going to cook this, we're going to fry this. Okay? You just cook that until the sauce is absorbed or the liquid is absorbed. The mixture is already dry, so we stop, okay? And then, we, this is probably, the vegetables are probably still a little bit firm, but that's alright because we're still going to fry this, okay? 
So what we will do now is drain this because we want our filling dry, okay? For the vegetable lumpia, we need a paste. Uh, two tablespoons flour, two tablespoons water, or in case you forget, remember it's one is to one. If it's one tablespoon of flour, one tablespoon of water. Anyway, this does not have to be very exact. Okay? As long as it has a paste-like consistency and it's, it's easy for you to spread out, then this is good. Okay? Here. You can use egg, you can use water, you can use cornstarch, but for me, this is the best paste. Okay? This is the spring roll wrapper. Don't hold it that way, this way. Okay? It's a diamond shape. Okay, let's put about maybe one fourth cup or three tablespoons. Okay, okay, like this. Put it on this side, okay? And then push back, okay? Push back to tighten. Close this and then roll, okay? And then we put the paste. You can use a brush, okay? And this is your lumpia. Okay, you can uh, prepare that and then you can freeze. If you want to fry straight from the freezer, fry it, don't thaw it out. I'll make another one. Then look like this and then push back. You know what's important is the filling should have like two layers. If you want more paste, just make more, okay? It's better to have less than more, okay? And then continue. I have many recipes to share with you. If you're interested, please like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can be alerted when a new video is uploaded. Right. we take this out okay um, here if you move the camera here you know when you make lumpia always drain it standing so that the oil will drain in the bottom because if you do it this way this one will be soggy you want as little portion to retain the oil so the tip is the smallest portion okay 